Welcome to Word Empowerment and welcome to the new month of June. The end of the month is a time for praise and worship and celebrating the King of Glory. And the beginning of the month is time for us to celebrate and still worship the King of Kings in our lives. We know that if he had not been the Lord who was on our side, when we went through those difficult challenges in the month of May, you know, when our finances were going, were, were kind of dancing, not adding up, when we were going through some challenging times in our marriage, you know, when our children were, were, were kind of falling sick, if he had not been the Lord who was on our side, we would not have come out from that situation strong and mighty like we did. It has been the Lord all through that has seen you. You know, you got in the same accident that others got involved and lose their lives or lose their mobility. You got in the same accident and you are safe if he had not been the Lord who was on your side. You know, when you went through that financial situation in your business and you thought you were going to lose your business or you thought your business was going to crumble, but the Lord showed up mightily in your life. So the end of the month and the beginning of the month is a time for celebration because of all the goodness of the Lord, because of all the great things the Lord has done. Done. Therefore, we open our mouth and celebrate Master Jesus. We open our mouth and we say, Father, you are faithful for all the lovely things that you have done, for preservation in our life, for your love and kindness that we have seen. My God, we have seen you in every direction. We have seen you in every area in our life. Therefore, we say, take your glory and your honor. Take your praises and adoration because you are God and you are faithful. You never change the same yesterday, the same today, and will be the same forever. Thank you, Jesus, for all your love. In Jesus' mighty name. This is what the Lord has in store for you in the month of June. Psalms 1 verse 2 and 3. Verse 2 says, Whose delight is in the law of the Lord? Who meditates on the law day and night? Child of God, this is the instruction for the month of June. That you should meditate on the word of God day and night. Because your solution lies in the words of the Lord. Everything you need to prevail in this month lies in the words of God. Everything you need to succeed in every area of your life lies in the words of God. Verse 3 of Psalms 1 says, That person is like a tree planted by the sides of rivers, which yield its fruits in the appropriate season and its leaves does not wither. Child of God, whatever you need in the month of June is in the word of the Lord. As you stay closer to God through his word, as you study in the words of God, as you meditate on the words of God, as you dwell in the presence of the Lord through his word, everything you need to excel in this month of June will be made available for you in the mighty name of Jesus. We are going to continue to read that verse. He said, what? So ever they do the prosper. So whatever you need in this month of June, dwell on the words of God. As you draw closer to God in his word, whatever you need in this month of June is made available for you in the name of Jesus. As you meditate on the words of God, whatever you do, whatever you need in your business, whatever you need in your career, whatever you need, my God, in your marriage, whatever you need in your marriage, ministry is made available for you in the mighty name of Jesus. I begin to pray for you that in this month of June, you will excel in the mighty name of Jesus. My God, in this month of June, you will be victorious in the mighty name of Jesus. My God, that you will not lack anything in this month. In the mighty name of Jesus, your health is in good shape. In the mighty name of Jesus, your finances are increasing in an upward movement in the mighty name of Jesus. My God, your marriage is blessed in the name of Jesus. My God, everything you touch will prosper in the name of Jesus. Every place you step your feet on, you possess in the mighty name of Jesus. My God, spirit 
spiritually, you are growing forward in the name of Jesus. You will lack nothing and every heart desire, my God, of yours is met in this month of June. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will not die in this month of June. In the name of Jesus, you will not sorrow over a lost one in this a loved one in this month of June, in the mighty name of Jesus, you will not be accidented in this month of June, in the mighty name of Jesus, my God, nothing will die in your hands, in the name of Jesus, everything you touch will grow, in the mighty name of Jesus, your life is improving in this month in the name of Jesus. My God, everything around you is improving in the name of Jesus. Your children are blessed in this month in the name of Jesus. Their lives are preserved in the name of Jesus. Your parents' lives are preserved in the name of Jesus. Spiritually, your eyes are opening to new rings in the name of Jesus. My God, your life is onto a forward and upward cause in the mighty name of Jesus. You are blessed this morning. You are favored in the name of Jesus. My God, the face of the Lord shine on you this morning in the name of Jesus. And you will see the hand of God in your life in this month of June in the mighty name of Jesus. As you study the word in this month of June, you will understand it more than ever before. That scriptures will begin to make sense to you. That every scripture you study, my God, will have a message for you, will have a solution for you. That you will understand the word of God more than ever before in this month. That your spiritual eyes are opening to great and mighty things through the word in the mighty name of Jesus. Therefore, at this point, we declare the month of June, the month of word manifestation. Hallelujah. Welcome to the month of word manifestation. Thank you, Father. Thank you for the word. Thank you, my God, for solutions in our hands. I thank you because we will find everything, my God, in your faithful ways. We give you the glory. We give you the honor. You are faithful. You are worthy to be praised in our lives. We thank you for making a way for us. We thank you for taking us, my God, places in this month. We thank you for solutions in our hands. We thank you for upliftment in our lives. We thank you, my God, for prosperity. We thank you for love. We thank you for victories. We thank you for success. We glorify you because you are faithful and you are God. There is none like you. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.